Opportunity. One UW Whitewater grad was one of 12 people killed last July when a gunman opened fire in a Colorado movie theater. But John Larimer's name will live on through a new scholarship. AJ Bayatpour has a story you'll see only on Fox 6. I can't think of a better legacy for somebody than to allow the college scholarship program to develop the people to preserve and promote history. And Scott Larimer knows history. As a hobby, he travels from state to state reenacting the Civil War and War of 1812. It's a little surprise his son John majored in history at UW-Whitewater. Well, the younger Larimer went even further, taking an active role in the university's History Honor Society. In fact, he became active in that Honor Society very early on in his academic career. Usually we see students who are juniors and seniors very active in Phi Alpha Theta. John became active in that organization when he was a sophomore. After leaving Whitewater, Larimer became a fourth generation sailor. The Navy stationed him in Aurora, Colorado. Just a couple months after arriving at his new home, Larimer was killed along with 11 others when a gunman opened fire at the Century 16 Theater. You're speechless on what, what to say, what to think. Um, and to hear that we have ties to a, uh, one of the victims um, of the tragedy itself. And, and the close ties, it's just, once again, you're speechless. Ryan Burback and Kelly Kavaman, both board members of Phi Alpha Theta, approached history chair Anthony Gulig wanting to honor Larimer. But the group decided a monument was not enough. When we got the letter, we, um, we talked about it as a family. We are a very close family. So uh, uh, John's uh, one other brother and three sisters, we chatted about this. And I don't think it took us very long to think that this was a very good idea. With the family's approval, the John T. Larimer Scholarship was formed. The annual scholarship will be awarded to a history major or minor. Something that pleases one history buff in particular. History is so important to us. It's in every form of our daily life, even though we don't always see it. History is there. In death, John Larimer may now help someone else make history. In Whitewater, AJ Bayapur, Fox 6 News. If you'd like to donate to the John Larimer Scholarship Fund, we have a link on our website, so come to fox6now.com. Well, you know, the holidays can be expensive.